Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. This is going to be a short reading. Love could come up, career and finance. We're just going to see what the cards have to tell you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It's much appreciated. Let's go ahead and jump into this Scorpio. Thank you Lord God for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see. The Four of Swords. All right. So you could be taking a break from someone um, because or someone's taking a break from you. It could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They have suspicions of cheating, infidelity. Something's going on here. Right now, you're in a situation, a relationship where this present time is make it or break it time. Like somebody's going to come through and show up or not. And uh, you both are maybe in your respective corners thinking about what the future holds here. Yeah, the eight of wands and then there could be communication fast swift communication uh, maybe moving forward declaring your intentions in terms of this relationship there could also be someone trying to sweep the other person off their feet you know make them fall in love again um, this is coming from a place of ego and maybe even obsession or infatuation definitely highly sexual energy um, somebody wants something to move forward quickly okay there will be some opportunity for you guys to speak to hash it out to talk about the trouble the jealousy within the connection also maybe come to some resolution all right and what else do we have for my scorpio okay the queen of wands this is typically my gemini female card um so it looks like somebody really desires you they really like you they really want to be with you um there's a lot of desire here um, they also could see that you get a lot of attention that you can attract um, very easily or you manifest very easily here. The Queen of Wands, it says that somebody's trying to move something fast, um, get a lot done in a short amount of time. This could be you, Gemini. Excuse me, it could be a Gemini. Why am I saying Gemini and a Scorpio? Scorpio, this could be you and how somebody views you. Somebody could definitely be dealing with a Gemini. I'm not going to take this down. But this is Scorpio's reading. Scorpio, you could be having conversation with someone who you find very attractive, or this is them, and uh, or this is you. This is how they view you, Scorpio. Um, the Queen of Wands, um, highly seductive, uh, creative, imaginative, charismatic, outgoing, personable, uh, entrepreneurial spirit gets a lot done in a short amount of time. Um, could be the mom. Uh, the soccer mom, the wife, you know, she she wears a lot of hats here. So Scorpio, this is how somebody is looking at you. Um, let's see here, the Six of Pentacles. Somebody wants to gift you um, something, Scorpio. You are a gift someone else something. Somebody feels like the power dynamic is off now. Like you've taken your power back here. Um, and they, they feel like now they may be on the receiving side waiting for you to reach out to them waiting for you to speak to them to give them just a little bit maybe they bread crumb bread crumbed you in the past and maybe you'll be doing that now or you just don't have a lot of time energy effort to devote to this because you are also devoting your time energy effort resources to something else or to someone else it looks like options are now available with the six of pentacles yeah the power dynamic has shifted somebody used to have the power and now the other person doesn't you know it's just role reversal in terms of the power dynamic now somebody is chasing after you as you used to chase after them or vice versa this is what's going on for you scorpio let's see at the bottom of the deck we have yeah the will of fortune the will of change um you don't control this a cycle is ending it has ended something else has started uh, the will is always turning for all of us. Um, it rains on the just and the unjust. Good happens to bad. Bad happens to good. It is the cycle of life. Um, you could feel like somebody is your soulmate. They could feel this way about you. There's something destined about this connection or about this time period. Also, because this talks about divinity and um, perfect timing, divine timing. Um, again, you could just be feeling like you, you've gotten your power back or you've gotten out of a cycle or a spiral. 
you're allowing for changes to happen in your life, Scorpio. You also could be practicing tarot, something about the esoteric, the stars, uh, astrology here. Um, and if you are, it looks like you're getting patronized, but doing so, yeah, you're very attractive to your um, patrons, to your counterparts, to your coworkers, something of that nature. Make time to rest, heal, meditate, because life is going to go really quickly for you, especially in business finance. Scorpio, if this reading resonates for you, go over to the website, book your reading there, and take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Scorpio. Many blessings to you. Take care.